Diamond Painters. I have a really special sneak peek for you today of a diamond painting kit from one of the newest artists at Pam Diamond Paintings. Let's go ahead and unroll this canvas and take a look and see what we have. Oh my goodness. Is this not the coolest Cheshire cat you have ever seen? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and roll this um, in the opposite direction, see if I can get it to lay flat. Um, all of Pam Diamond Painting's um, canvases are made from a very uh, soft um, lint back canvas. So they're very flexible and very easy to work with. Wow, oh my gosh. Look at the beautiful, bold colors on this canvas in this piece of artwork. Wow. Okay, let me tell you a little bit about the artwork and the artist behind it. Um, this is Cheshire Cat. Um, this is art uh, that has been created by Elisabetta Stoinich of Mrs. Peggotty Arts. Um, I first became aware of Mrs. Peggotty Arts through the worlds of cross stitch and adult coloring. Those are two other hobbies that I have in addition to diamond painting, although diamond painting will always be my favorite of the three. Um, so I first discovered Elisabetta's um, artwork through Etsy, and I will be sure to include a link, a direct link to her shop um, in the description below, so that you, if you're interested in her coloring her art or cross-stitching her art, um, you can see what she has available in her Etsy shop. But we are so lucky here at Pam Diamond Paintings to have been able to license um, her artwork to turn them into diamond paintings for those of you who really love diamond painting to enjoy. Um, I will say that her artwork is definitely a color blocker's dream. So if you enjoy color blocking, um, you're really gonna love Mrs. Peggotty's um, artwork. Um, I will say that the the main focus of uh, Elisabetta's artwork um, does lie in the world of literature. Um, she focuses a lot on characters, creating characters from liter classic literature, children's literature. Um, she's also branched out into um, creating artwork from different characters from TV shows and pop culture. So she has a whole line of um, artwork she's created of famous detectives, television detectives. So we have um, currently have her Agent Cooper from Twin Peaks as well as Magnum P.I. And we will bringing, we will also be bringing more of um, her detective artwork to you. But okay, let's go ahead and take a closer look at this canvas. Um, I am going to see if I can zoom in without messing it up too bad. Nope, that was a zoom out. Let's zoom in. I will get the hang of this eventually. Okay, look at that grin. Guys, is he not the cutest Cheshire cat you've ever seen? Okay, let's go ahead and take a look here at the upper left-hand corner. This is a 50 by 70 centimeter canvas. And there is a legend in the top right-hand corner, as well as a legend in the lower left-hand corner. Now, there are 40 colors in this canvas. Let's see if I can bring it a little bit closer for you. There are 40 different colors, and um, it looks like there are three special, special drills at the bottom. Um, and I actually believe this kit has, uh, it has some of our fairy dust drills, or I'm sorry, twinkle dust drills. Um, so yeah, there are tw uh, three, looks like three twinkle dust drills in, included on this, uh, for this canvas. And this is a round drill, a round drill canvas kit. So, um, you can see here. Now, uh, it looks like most of the symbols are alphanumeric, which I, 
I particularly love as a diamond painter. So where you have a one here, um, that's number one um, on the legend. So the uh, numbers do match up with the corresponding numbers on the legend. Um, and then it's gonna go, so from numeric through the alphabet here, and then it's not until the last, it looks like six symbols, or uh, six, the last six colors on the legend are symbols. So yeah, I think that, that's one thing I really love about, um, about Pam Diamond Paintings kits is that alphanumeric, I think, is really, um, it makes it a little less confusing to work on. While I have this canvas close to the camera, I think you can see how clear the printing is. Oh yes. Very clear. You can see there are some very, uh, there are very, very, very faint uh, guide circles here. Um, just to help you uh, place, place your drills a little more straight. We're all mad here at the bottom. Okay. Let's see if I can look at a little bit more of the detail on the canvas. What I, one thing I really love about um, the artwork of Elizabetta is in the, it's not just the character um, itself that's so captivating, it's also the backgrounds that um, that she makes to go along with the characters. So as you can see, there's a bow here. Um, there's a really ornate floral pattern um, on all four of the corners. Um, there is a really cool like scallop design around the entire um, oval that this, uh, that the Cheshire Cat is in. So yeah, and just the bold colors are really what make this just pop. I mean, look at those eyes and that grin. Oh, I'm so excited. I can't wait to work on this. And of course, we're all mad here at the bottom. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at the drills. Um, and I will really quickly show you the the toolkit that is included with all of all of our kits here at Pan Diamond Paintings. I'm not going to take everything out of the bag, but it is an organza bag. It includes a boat, uh, one container of red wax, washi tape here. Um, you have a skinny pen and an orange um, squishy to make it a little more comfortable to work with. Um, tweezers, and then there are several multi placers in here. I don't know if you can see them, but there's one here. There's another here. Um, so yeah, that's our basic toolkit. Everything that you need to get started. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at the drills. Look, the drills all come in a plastic bag here. Oh, look at those yummy, bright jewel tone colors. Okay, let's go ahead and open this up. Do excuse the crinkles. I will try to get this done as soon as possible. Okay, all of our kits include a sticker sheet and what you can do with this sticker sheet is you can you can cut out uh, the symbol and the color combo and stick them off. If you do use a, um, a container system for kitting up, you can cut those out and put them on your containers. I use a tower system. Um, and I just cut them out and stick them on, on each tray. And then there's also a thumbnail here of the, of Elizabeth's original artwork of the Cheshire Cat. And that's perfect for cutting out and sticking in your, um, in your diamond painting log if you, if you keep one of those to keep track of your progress and your projects. So that's the sticker sheet. All right, let's go ahead and get into these drills. I'm going to see if I can pull them out and kind of um, sort them by color or color family. So I'm gonna go ahead and take out all of the purples and pinks and reds. I'm sure you can tell from the Cheshire Cat himself, uh, this, he is going to be mainly reds, purples, and pinks. Okay. So all of our kits do come pre-bagged. So what's cool about that is that if you choose to work out of, um, out of the bags, they're already um, in bags and ready to go. So yeah, um, that's something convenient for all of you who choose to just open up your kit and, and start going right away without, without having to kit up. 
Okay, so these are all of the pinks, purples, and reds. Um, this is a darker burgundy. Okay, so those are all the reds and purples and pinks. I'm going to move those out of the way. Okay. Next up, we have the blues. A lot of these are going to go in the backgrounds here. Um, so, blues. It's a really big bag of 939, which is a very dark blue, almost a blue-black color. Um, that's going to go in a lot of the background in the oval here. Um, that's surrounding the Cheshire Cat. Okay, a lot of blues in this, lots of different shades. Oh, it's a really pretty teal color. Oh, I'm in love with the jewel colors in this one. Okay, and I'm gonna go ahead and include these with the blues and black, or a blues and uh, dark blues. These are kind of like a gray, gray color, different shades of grays. So yeah, even though there is a lot of color blocking in this kit, it is rather deceiving. Um, there are a lot more colors than you think would be in a, in a kit like this. So it's going to be fun to see um, how everything's been rendered and how all the colors are going to flow together, even though it is mainly a color block um, diamond painting kit. Okay, here are the oranges and yellows. This is a green color. Okay, and then lastly we have browns and taupes and beiges. Okay. And then last but not least, we have three of our specialty drills. These are Pam Diamond Painting's Twinkle Dust Drills. So it's gonna be very hard to capture um, on camera here, but they do have a very, a very subtle um, glitter, glittery coating on them. Um, so they just add a slightly different amount of sparkle. Oh, the coating on those pinks or uh, purples are beautiful. And I bet I'm not going to be able to capture those well on camera here. Um, but yeah, they're almost like a, kind of like a mica or a very light, uh, just a, they give everything, they, they give them a very light shimmery um, sheen, if that makes sense. Okay, so this is Cheshire Cat by Elisabetta Stoinich of Mrs. Peggy Arts. And you can find this kit available right now to purchase from pamdiamondpaintings.com. We do have more artwork coming very soon from Mrs. Peggy Arts. If you love color blocking, if you love really colorful characters from literature, um, from pop culture, you're really gonna love Mrs. Peggy Arts um, artwork. So yeah, let's take one last look at his amazing, amazingly expressive face with those large eyes and that grin. Wow, what an awesome portrayal of, of the Cheshire Cat. Okay, thank you so much for watching and uh, do like, uh, do follow or, just, or um, subscribe please and uh, we'll have some more sneak peeks coming to you very soon. Thanks guys. Happy diamond painting. <laughs>